And race number six now, good field coming up here. We have a look at it closer. It is a 1800 metre class three. Tianchi Monster, all wins have been this great. He does carry the 135 again. Rocket Spade, so close last time. Extra three pounds on that second behind Escape Route. Meaningful Star will resume. He went around in that void race, which was abandoned on the 22nd of February. Savvy Kingman, a three-time course and distance winner. Escape Route, of course, beat Rocket Spade. That was two starts ago for Escape Route. Super Oasis has the hood coming off. Satirical Glory to the 1800 for the first time in Righteous Doctrine. Has had the eight starts at Happy Valley, Nick, but his best form and certainly all winning form has been across that chart, Tim. It has, yeah, and uh, the speed map has, uh, has got predicted good to slow here. Savvy Kingman, we know, uh, does like to lead. He doesn't necessarily have to lead, and that's not always been the case with him, but uh, he can lead, and he he, uh, he might just get things to suit him here. Uh, Comet Splendido, I don't think it will be a million miles uh, off of him as well. Um, and also just in behind him, we've got Satirical Gloria, who shook at a nice run from gate number one, and he's been ridden prominently uh, in the majority of his starts as well. Pegasus General and, uh, and Super Oasis might just sit in behind. Super Oasis, Paul, was uh, was prominent last time, and he's drawn a good gate here in two. Yeah, so he should get a really nice run. Tianchi Monster's drawn the inside, he'll, uh, one of the inside gates, so he should get a nice run, sort of midfield there, economical. Uh, look, Rocket Spade will have to go to the back, I think, with the escape route from his wide draw. I think Rocket Spade, they'll try and get straight down to the rail behind the field. Well, he features in our first replay, Paul, and uh, this is Escape Route just beating him, Nick, but Rocket Spade, surely a win can't be too far away. Exactly. Look, I, I certainly agree. Um, I mean, he's done all bar win, hasn't he, in his last couple of starts. I mean, he's gone uh, really close on this occasion. Escape Route has had a, another run since, but there's a whole host of horses uh, coming through the race. Comet Splendido, I think, might just be sort of up against it off his mark. Tanchi Monster might be actually well handicapped on the pick of his form, but I think this is Rocket Spade's race um, race for the losing, pull. Yeah, I agree totally. Look, don't forget he is a Group 1 winner as well yes. before he got here. We've just had that race, haven't we? Yeah, in New Zealand Derby when he did win that. So... Look, he, he's, he's taken a little while to acclimatise. He's come up and trip now. The 1,800 metres looks ideal. We move on from the rocket pool to round the earth. His form's <laughs> been a little hard to catch. He has run on a few times like there's a win in him not that far away. He has a bit of money from too uh, early. He's uh, in single figures at round the earth. He's by Sava Bill, so another one that does like the, the longer trips. Uh, this run for fourth here at um, Sha Tin was uh, very good, I thought, uh, behind Woodfire Bro, who's in, been in great form. And you'll notice the horse there in the orange, purple and white. That's Champion Dragon, who's who's won recently as well. So the form is pretty good. And he ran last in Rocket Spade's recent trial, but I think it was just a case of a maintenance trial and an easy time for him. And finally, Nick, we were due to see Meaningful Star last time, as mentioned, but that race was called off. He's only had the two trials since his last race in February 2022. Yeah, look, this is his, uh, his Happy Valley Trial 28th of, of Jan. Um, now, the interesting thing with this guy is now, look, I know it was a void race and they didn't go all that far, but <laughs> trying to make some sort of case for him, he's actually one second up. So he's been to the races, Paul. He's had a bit of a hit mm -hmm. out. I just wonder if that would have brought him on enough to, to show that second up form again, perhaps. Uh, it could only help, couldn't it, yeah. I suppose, because uh, he'd been off for a long period of the race. All right, uh, all right, Paul, who do you like in race number six? I think Rocket Spade will win this, so he's clearly on top for me. Tianchi Monster, look, he's uh, in the right grade as well, and he should get a nice run just on the inside there. Sevi Kingman, now, if they do leave Malone in front, which they have done in the past, and he, he he's a hard horse, he's a big horse, and he can be a hard horse to get past. And I thought Satirical Glory would, from that inside draw should get a really nice run just in behind the pace. Two, one, five, and ten. Yeah, I've also got Rocket Spade here. Uh, anyone that's uh, got a keen eye for the trials have noticed that he did take a little while to pull up after that, that recent trial. He hit the line extremely strongly. So, look, I think he's ready to win. Meaningful star. Uh, the method in my madness is that he has had half a race, if you will, and hopefully that's not the cobwebs away for him to go well uh, and show his second up form. Round the earth goes in. I think there's uh, a bit happening around him. And Tanchi Monster up at the top. He's off a decent mark nowadays, and he's got a, a sound enough course and distance record as well. Two, three, nine, and one. And race number six is the first leg of the third double trio.